Hi guys, how are we this uh, fine Saturday? Um, been a busy morning today with customers, visitors, coming in for bats and just just finished off. Shannon's just doing the last of it now actually for me. Uh, all our packaging, ready to go out on Monday. Uh, but since we did our little YouTube video just on what we'd been up to since we last posted on YouTube because I haven't done it for so long. Um, we've had a few people dropping his messages actually just about the workshop and what the photos were um, in the workshop and um, we get a lot of people coming in particularly with um, with the the kids the kids haven't got a clue who the people are on these photos but the, the dads are <laughs> and the dads spend more time looking at these and asking stories but basically they're all what we've got up here, we've still got loads more to go up actually in some autograph cricket bats and things like that. But basically changing room photos from my playing days. So when I was playing, I used to take a few photos in the changing rooms when I was away on trips or just little things that, um, that sort of perhaps didn't mean as much then, but mean a lot now. And we've, they were just stashed in drawers, um, hidden away. And when we did this, Sharon thought it'd be a good idea to, to tell the story because this is where it, it all stems from. What we do now is where it all stems from. So all these photos in this bit here are sort of changing room photos. So you've got some very famous faces all the way down. There's some Derbyshire cricketing days. There's Glenn McGraw there. There's the great Dean Jones there. Absolutely fantastic. Yours truly. Um, go down through the lights. There's one down there somewhere of a, is on a restaurant table. And unfortunately, Mr. Warren got cut off the end of it, so it didn't quite fit in there, but <laughs> we've got another photo of that. Um, but some really, really nice photos. These ones up, well, that's um, that's a scorecard. I'm gonna get it on the thing. That's a scorecard of um, it's not my debut actually. I made my first class debut, county debut at Lords, but that one's 1999. I haven't actually got one of my debut, sadly. I keep trying to get one, but um. But uh, that's of Lords in 1999. It was my first game back after I'd bust my ribs. I was about halfway through the season. That's that was my memorable year where I took took 50 wickets in about eight games, seven games, I think it was. Um, and then all these. That's Carl Cricken's benefit. Yeah, that was a photo that we did. And then all of these are just photos that. Um, supporters have sent in actually over the years so that's against Pakistan one day um, that was against India that's Mr Dravid at the non-strikers end um, that one is my first year on the staff against Nottinghamshire that's Usman Afsal that uh, I'm hitting and that's the great Tim Robinson the hero of mine and those are photos of the year i got capped 1999 became a capped county cricketer much sought after thing baby face <laughs> these ones down here the frame so behind these bats here that's uh, from our winter in australia with the great australian cricket team um for the millennium so we had the fortune of spending our time traveling with those guys and you know and spending time with them uh, and that that was actually so that that one's from warney's restaurant um, and these are from new year's eve overlooking sydney harbour bridge in sydney yeah so um just we've got a load more of those that we're going to put up um we've got sort of autographed bats down there with mike hendrick that's that's when the gathering for mike hendrick before he passed away 
and that's got uh, a lot of the 81 Ashes team there, which uh, from a get together I was very, very honoured to be invited to. That's obviously Mr. Viv Richards, something that we did for him. Um, and then people ask what that is. That's my county cap. So 1999, that's capped on the field. The other marvellous game. And then, of course, Lords in the background because that's where I made my uh, county, proper county first class debut. Um, so it's all sort of memorabilia, really. Um, and, of course, uh, you can't forget. He's the reason I wanted to be a professional cricketer. You always say don't meet your heroes, but... He's never let me down yet whenever I've met him. What, what, a, what an inspirational guy. Um, yeah, so that's it really, guys. That's what it is. And we, we keep trying to add stuff when we get time. And we've got loads of stuff to go in there. And the autograph bat's got... But it sort of tells a story. And that's why we've done it, really. So um, I hope that answers those who are asking. And uh, we'll give you one last little scan of... So you can see, see who you recognise and see who you don't. And there we go. I can't quite get right down there for you, but there we go. There we go. Bye-bye.